hop off the ship like no gangsters and say, You, you this bitch, bitch what? Let's go. what? Warning. This video contains super awesome content not suitable for people who don't enjoy super awesomeness. Yo, what's up with you guys, man? It's your boy Blast it. We're gonna be reacting to some more Rashad Jamal, bro. I'm starting to learn a lot of things, but I've been getting a lot of hate in the comments. I've been getting more love and hate in comments, but just wanted to let you guys know, man. In no way do I mean to be perfect. Somebody actually commented on my poster saying it's demonic, bro. It probably is demonic, nigga, but I believe in God, bro. I'm a man. I'm a, I'm a Christian, bro. You know? Look at this, bro. I, I don't got the angel tatted on me for no reason, my guy. You feel me? I got the man tatted on me, bro. I got him tatted on me. <laughs> it doesn't make me a bad person for having this poster up. You feel me? RPX, RP Lil Peep, RP Juice World, man. RP Dre. RP Dre, RP Kobe, RP to Gigi, man. You know, a lot of these people on here actually had an impact in my life. And, um, you know, hey, everybody gravitates to different things, man. But no way am I a Satanist or a Satanic worshiper, bro. So I'm sorry if I got that, but you guys are misconstrued. But right now, we're going to be watching some Rachad Jamal videos. I'm learning a lot from him. Let me know if this is the only person that you guys would like to see. Is there anybody else that's kind of like Rashad Jamal's level speaking about the same truth um, that you would like for me to react to? I know there's Young Pharaoh, but honestly, I really can't gravitate to Young Pharaoh. If there's a video that you guys would like for me to react to, to Young Pharaoh, drop it below. Drop it below. But I don't know why I really mess with Rashad Jamal, bro, because... I can see he's authentic, bro. And he, I can just relate to him. You feel me? I'm not saying I'm the toughest guy. I'm not saying I killed a nigga before and got out and beat the charge. I'm just saying, I don't know. We all resonate with different people, bro. But yeah, man. But yeah, man, if you could do me a favor, bro, like this video right here. Like the video right here. And subscribe, man. It means a lot. You guys want to support your fellow black YouTuber. You feel me? But yeah, man. And expect more content from me, bro. I'm investing in a lot of equipment. Probably gonna start messing around with these public pranks. So, expect a lot of different type of content from me. And if you guys don't like the type of content that I upload, just don't watch the video because there's gonna be content that you would like to see. I'm just trying to make content for a broader audience. But yeah, man, hope you guys understand. I'm just a new YouTuber on the rise. And yeah, bro, let's get right into the video. God damn, Rashad! Shot! This is a 30 minute video, Rashad! Am I supposed to re react to a 30 minute video, Rashad? I don't know we're gonna be able to do all this, my guy. We're gonna try. We definitely gonna try. <laughs> Let's get right into the video. In every movie, they made the bad guys look bad when the bad guys were the good guys and the good guys were the bad guys. That's how Satan tricks you to root for him. He did the same thing with his religion, he tricked you into worshiping him. In every movie, they made the bad guys look bad when the bad guys were the good guys and the good guys were the bad guys. That's how Satan tricks you to root for him. He did the same thing with his religion. He tricked you into worshiping him. Religion is the worship of Satan, not God. God doesn't worship anything outside of himself. God doesn't worship anything outside of herself. All right? All right? God doesn't need nobody to serve him or her because God is all knowing, all loving, right? We don't need nobody to serve us. That ain't what we never did. Only one of our brothers did that and his name was Yaqub. And they tried to hide him in religion and call him Satan. And then they hid him in Greek mythology and called him Zeus. What? Prometheus. He was a jealous God. He was jealous of all of us. Although he had no reason to be. This mythological creature of Satan. Get that shit out of your mind. He looked just like me and you. Carbonated pinion. That's your brother. Yes. Satan is our brother. He's one of the gods. Which is why in religion. They taught you that he was one of the angels. Didn't they? That's facts. That's they facts. did it. It said he was one of the angels. Don't forget that Satan is a god. Don't ever forget that. That's why he has power. But not more power than you. You know why? Because Satan is on the true dark side of the force, which is that Jedi Knight side. 
when he create when he went against us. He went against himself. But he is a trickster. He is. He is very wise because he is a god. So he <coughs> tricked us into worshiping him. Religion is the worship of Satan, not God. Religion is the worship, not just Christianity, all religion. That's why it divides people. It separates people. It takes your energy. It takes your money. It gives you false hopes. It gives you hope. Hope ain't real in the universe. Ain't no such thing as no motherfucking hope. Facts. Ain't Facts. no such thing as trying. Either it is or, or it's it not. Ain't. Facts. If anybody tell you I'm working on some shit, it's a gin in them. If anybody spell cast to say I'm trying, it's a gin on them. So Archon within that avatar. We are gods. We don't try to do shit. We do or we don't. Ain't no such thing as hope. Either it is or it isn't. Hope is what got generations of us fucked up spiritually. Hoping on some shit. When has hope ever worked in your life? In your real life, nigga? Hey, honestly, I never even thought about it this way, bro. Everything that he's saying makes sense. I'm not saying I agree with every word that he says, but about the hope thing, it does make sense. I just got to get enlightened more, man. You know, I'm kind of new to these type of topics, so I will catch on. And hopefully, you know, we I've been learning some stuff. I'm not saying that I'm perfect. Did you hope to pay your bills, nigga? No, nigga, you went and paid your bills. Do you hope to raise your kids? No, you raise your kids. Or you don't raise your kids. You don't, know, you don't need no book to tell you that. So... This is how they do because they are the seeds of Satan. Satan was the father of tricknology for it is the weapon that he gave his creation. Never underestimate the power of a lie. You crazy? That's the worst weapon for a motherfucker to lie to you. I'd rather be around a murderer, a thief, than a liar. Because with a murderer, I know how he coming. He a killer, I know he going to kill something. He a drug dealer, I know he going to sell some drugs. He's religious, I know he's going to worship God. He's a thief, he going to steal some shit. But with a liar, you will never know. No lie, Rashad Jamal, bro, he really will have you think. How they coming. Never know how they coming. When they come in, where they come in, or even why they are coming. Our oppressors, these human beings, are master manipulators. Facts. Remember, family, how did they take this planet from you? They didn't come take it like no gorillas. Nigga, they didn't hop off the ship like no gangsters to say, Nigga, we want this bitch to let's go. What? No, they didn't. They came like the cowards they always be in, nigga. They came deceptively. See what I'm saying? Facts! Hi, facts, we nigga. Peace. Facts. Can, can y'all teach us? They over here asking y'all to teach us, teach us everything you guys know, man. Thanksgiving come, everybody did. My guy. Sup. Love y'all. We worship y'all. We, wow, we've never seen. Can we learn from you? Nigga, they sat down with us. They sat down. A section of them that we allowed to sit down with us. And, they, and let them scribe. We never had scribes. We didn't scribe shit. We inscribe, nigga.
We ain't got to scrap shit. We are Alpha and Omega. We didn't even talk using words. We used telepathy. We wasn't writing no motherfucking books. When I'm sitting here talking to y'all, do you see me with a book, nigga? They can, they still have yet to fully understand us. You feel me? Right now, they don't understand us. They don't understand you. They don't understand you at all. So they have to excavate the ground every day and dig you up. You know that that soil is you. You know that, right? Yeah, you know that. That's you. So they have to excavate you every day and dig you up to study you. They have no clue still of exactly what you are at full capacity. So they have to go jump in your ocean. You do know that, that the ocean is an actual spirit and soul. And it's one of our ancestors that was placed there in the war that we lost, right? What if I told you that the ocean is not? That big ass body of water is an actual living being. A colossal force that was placed there in the war that we lost in 1492. That'll blow your mind, right? But it's true. It goddamn did already. What was the name of one of the titans? Ocean. Atlas was a titan. Ocean was a titan. Go look at the Titan War in Greek mythology. Roman Roman mythology. Go look at it. Remember, remember who Zeus is too. Remember I told you Zeus is Satan now. Keep that in your mind and then go read Greek mythology. And then go read the Bible. And then you tell me if all that shit ain't the same story. That's fucking crazy. Let him who has eyes see clearly, man. Okay. So... With you not knowing that Zeus was Satan, you didn't know that he was telling the story in Greek mythology what really happened. But now that I'm telling you that Zeus is Satan and you've been enlightened, now go back and look at the story of the Titan War. What happened in the Titan War? Let's do a quick, let me give you a quick synopsis of what took place in the Titan War. So Zeus went to war. You know, I'm telling you how they said it. You know, Zeus went to war with, keep in mind, Zeus is Satan. Zeus went to war with his parents. Cronus and Rhea and they tell you that Cronus and Zeus's dad and his mom were gods titans so keep in mind if Zeus was this powerful god in Greek mythology then what the fuck was his dad and his mom and the titans who came before him that just went so, over my head I ain't gonna lie to you how, what happened to the titans how did Zeus take power and create Mount Olympus along with his 12 gods with him being... Y'all conscious don't stand a chance because then it's going to play on your conscience immediately. This nigga fucking with my mind right now. <laughs> How do you say Zeus Hola, or Espanol. Jesus rather Hola, in Spanish? Espanol. You say, hey, Zeus. Now, who created the Spanish language? Where were they from? Spain. I feel like, like I'm in school right now. Goddesses. You're not Spanish. Because the original, because Spain, the original the Spanish comes from Spain. Now, what color was the original Spaniards? Asking questions for a friend. See how they tricky? See how cold blooded Zeus is with it? Because Spain, the original the Spanish, comes from Spain. Now, what color was the original Spaniards? Asking questions for a friend. Damn, nigga, I want to know the answer. Tricky. See how cold blooded Zeus is with it? AKA Satan. He got you to worship him in religion that he created to divide us against us. 
because he tells you in his Bible for Satan. This is verbatim out the Bible. Satan so cold with it. Zeus so cold with it. He tells you a house divided against itself cannot stand. Like I have a Jesus, a Jesus's face on my arm. My nigga, y'all show me these videos, bro. You feel me? Oh no, I don't know, man. But yeah, if you guys like to see me react to more Rashad Jamal videos, like this video, man. If you guys have some info or some knowledge you guys would like to speak to me, let me know, man. My Instagram is Yo Blasted. Leave it in the comment section. Whatever you guys want to do, man. Just make sure you guys like this video. But yeah, man, I appreciate you guys and have a good day.